Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about iPhone, iTunes history and how to view your app store purchase history. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, why would you want to look at the iPhone, iTunes history? Possibly you're tallying up how much you've been spending on apps or looking for a specific transaction or see what types of apps you have downloaded. And that's usually the reason why you would want to look at the iTunes history. But how do you get there? Well, it's pretty easy. First off, go ahead and open up your iPhone. I already have my iPhone open right here. And what you want to do next is click on the settings tab. And that is this little gear, gray gear icon right here. So I'm going to go ahead and open that up now. All right, I went ahead and opened up my settings tab for the iPhone. And next, what you want to do is go ahead and scroll down a little bit further. And you want to go to the iTunes button. And what you want to look for is the blue and white icon. So let me go ahead and go there now. All right, here we are right here. This is the iTunes and App Store icon right there. That's where you're going to find the history for App Store purchases. So I'm going to go ahead and click there now. All right, I went ahead and clicked on there now. And now you can see the iTunes and App Store settings. And here at the top, you can see your Apple ID. And usually that's going to be your email address. It might be different for you, but for me, it's my personal email address. And what you want to do is go ahead and click on the blue button. Apple ID. I'm going to go ahead and click on that now. All right, I went ahead and clicked on that. And then as you can see, the Apple ID prompt says view Apple ID, sign out, I forgot, or cancel. What you want to do is go ahead and click on view Apple ID, and that's going to open up your iTunes history. So I'm going to click there now. All right, I went ahead and opened that up, and now you can see the account settings. And what you want to do if you want to view the history of App Store purchases is just scroll down a little bit further. And then as you can see, it says purchase history. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that now. All right, and here you go. This is where you're going to find the iTunes purchase history for all the apps that you have purchased or downloaded. And the nice thing about this is it's set up in different segments. So initially, it's already been chosen that it's going to be the last 90 days worth of purchases. So these are the apps that I purchased within the past 90 days. Also right here, as you can see, I have Amazon Music. Amazon Music was not a charged app, but it still populates here even though it was free. Now, what if you want to go back further than 90 days? Well, that's pretty easy. All you want to do is go ahead and click right there where it says last 90 days. And as you can see, there's an arrow right next to it. And that's going to bring up a different setting. All right, so I went ahead and clicked on that. And then as you can see, you can see the historical purchases for your iTunes store. And for mine, it goes all the way back till 2011. I'm not sure if it stops at 2011 or if you can go before then. If you happen to know, be sure to leave me a comment below. One thing I know is I have had an iPhone since probably about 2010 maybe 2009. So I don't know what happened to the App Store purchases before then. If you're able to access years earlier than 2011, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know. But as far as I know, this is as far back as the iPhone iTunes history will take you. But hopefully you found the video useful. If so, click thumbs up and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.